Um, you joined the Torment FC last season. Uh, would you mind talking about what drew you to the club? Absolutely. Uh, when the Van Tassel family gave me a call last December and, and offered me the opportunity, um, you know, one of Darren Van Tassel's sayings is great things await. Uh, and I had no idea just how much was in store for this franchise in such a short period of time. I had an opportunity to work with a great group of people in a, in a very ambitious organization. Uh, but where we're heading now is just fantastic and it's really exciting. Tormart FC is a very successful PDL club. Uh, would you mind talking about what it's like to compete in the PDL? Absolutely. It's it's great to to see some of college soccer's best and even players that haven't played college soccer have an opportunity to prove themselves in a professional setting. Uh, if you look at the graphics in the PDL, so many of the players end up that end up getting drafted have come to the PDL. They end up getting USL contracts come to the PDL. So it surely is a proving ground to see if players can can adapt to those kind of situations, those kind of demands and professional expectations. And that's what we do with our players. We treat them like pros. We bring them in. Uh, nothing's different. They just don't get a contract. Uh, and the way we play, the way we expect them to handle themselves off the field, how to take care of their bodies, we try to give them a, a, just a snapshot of what it's like to be a pro and how they have to adapt and prepare to be one in the future. And so what is the role of the PDL sort of in developing these collegiate players into future professionals? Well, what I've enjoyed seeing is, especially from the NAI and D2 ranks, you see some really top players that may have not gotten picked up by a Division One program or um, just for whatever reason just was never picked up and, and they're crushing it in the PDL and it definitely raises their stack or, or their stock to go to the USO, possibly even the MLS. Um, I love seeing players that nobody knows about and then all of a sudden in the top 50 in the PDL and the top 25 and then the top 10 and they end up getting drafted or a contract within a year after graduation and that's that's the exciting part is just identifying top players that can be pros at the USL and potentially the MLS.